taking a designed chart of 20 cm of length and 4 cm of width. Now I am dividing this 4 cm into 3 parts that is 1.4, 1.2 and 1.4 again. You have to make these markings at both sides of the strip. Now I am just folding the strip so that I get a midpoint and just crease it well. This is gonna be very helpful to us. Again I am marking 1.4, 1.2 and 1.4. Now lifting one side of the strip to the mid and pressing out the sides. Here the motive is not to crease them permanently. These midpoints will help us to make a major curve. This is a major curve of the bow and we have to take care that it doesn't reach the mid. In the similar way I have made a curve adjacent to the previous curve. Now we need to find them and take care that they are similar to each other. There should be no dissimilarity before we cut them. Cutting them out, our desired shape will be something like that. Using this shape, we are gonna make the other lines or curves. First line will be traced by folding it one fourth. Second time, we will trace them by folding it half. I'm gonna cut the middle traced curves first of all. This is the shape we want on the other side too, so I'm gonna trace it again. And now I'm gonna cut these two. And with this, we are done with our major step. Now it's time to get started with our second step, of which I'm gonna take design sheet of 15 cm of length and 4 cm of width. And now I'm gonna fold it into half so that I can get a middle crease. Now it's time to trace for the last time. Taking my first piece over the other, I'll be tracing it from the mid so that I get a mountain kind of shape in the middle of our second strip. Something like that. Now I'm taking the midpoints of the both sides, that will be 2 cm. I'm very bad at cutting symmetrically with the hands, like freehandedly without scale. So I'm using these scale to make the small cutting too. But you can do it with your hands, like freehandedly without scale. We are ready with our base and now it's time for pasting. We have to stick them out. Take care that you apply the glue only at the center of the base. Similarly at the center of the ribbon and paste them out in the way I'm pasting in the video. In the last step we are gonna take the strip of 1 cm of width and 4 cm of length and gonna paste them in the way I'm showing in the video. I'll be giving all the description of the things and measurements I have used in this video in the description box. So if you liked what you just saw, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more stuff.